are you feeling stressed just thinking about going to work today? Maybe that's stemming from a big project you have or something you have to present to your boss in a few months. Or do you have a student athlete at home whose ability is being capped because of doubts swirling in their head? Well, Lisa met a woman who believes meditation allows breakthroughs to happen. It begins with the basics, but you'll hear how the basics can help you accomplish pretty extraordinary things. What is meditation exactly? and what type of meditation do you practice? Uh, meditation is really just a chance to allow your body to calm. There are so many different methods of meditation. So the meditation that I practice is through a school called Pranic Healing. Paula Lore brings people back to even at this studio called Body by Jim Roots and Fishers. She hasn't been meditating that long, only two years. When she started seeing the benefits in her life, such as more energy and less pain, she began teaching her daughter and other young athletes. Um, she competes gymnastics for Northern Illinois University. Yes, she was interviewed following their championships, and they asked her, what did you do back in the locker room before you came out? She, she, finished, the, she finished the team uh, performance with a 9-9 on beam. And had she not had the 9-9 on moment. beam, I know, right? They would not have won. So it's one of those things where wow, you can't have any more pressure on you. How do you handle that? And her first response was, well, I like to do meditation, so I did meditation before we came out. You know, you, you could go back and do that experiment over without the meditation and see what happens, but you know, you gotta give a little bit of credit or at least um, a nod to the fact that it put her in a state of mind where she literally could go out and do what she was capable of under pressure. Yeah. Paula suggests setting aside five minutes a day, just five minutes to meditate, and she says start with that. Yeah, there's so many different types of meditation. It can be intimidating maybe to get started. So during our 6 a.m. hour here at Sunrise today, Alyssa talks to Paula about who may benefit from using meditation apps and when it might be time to put the phone down.